we're going to be taking a look at the eye and the muscles around the eye. A very common problem is the muscle that looks at rotating or bringing the eye inward. So this nerve, the, the, the fourth cranial nerve, the trochlear nerve, can get pulled or yanked, uh, injured during a whiplash or a head injury. When that happens, the nerve uh, can have an entrapment or, or be held onto. It's still functioning, but it's like a six lane highway in, in LA. If you block any of those lanes, all of a sudden any buildup of traffic and, and, and stuff gets backed up. That's the same with nerves, is the amount of information going through requires that nerve to function fully. If there is a, a, an entrapment on the nerve, that limits the amount of signal that is going to the eye muscles. When that occurs, we can develop trigger points, pain in the eyes, but also a, a weakness of how the eyes look inward. Sometimes the eye will drift out, sometimes the eyes will shift back and forth. All of this uh, creates an incredible amount of workload on the brain that has to process all this information. Thank you.